Okay, now this one I am planning on, this is a little bit of an odd change, but it's, uh, it's these, this is a build that I have done before. And it's kind of a cool change in a way, or a cool body swap in a way. This is a 34 Ford. Um, really cool casting. Uh, I know it's black wall casting. Why am I cutting it up? Well, I've got other versions, and the purple really doesn't do it for me. So, um, yeah, it's, it's a cool car to modify, basically. And um, this chassis is actually a really good chassis to work with. But I'm not going to keep this chassis. <laughs> so, you know, you're probably asking, well, what are you doing, Chris? What, you know, uh, why, why would you take one good chassis out and put a different chassis on there? Well, this chassis is a really good chassis to use if you have like a full-bodied car that, that you're going to, um, that you're going to modify. Um, but what I'll be doing with this is I will be taking be taking this chassis, uh, chassis it. This this chassis was used in several different different cars. It was uh, it's under the AOK. -OK, it was under the Dumping A. It was there's several of them that use this same chassis. Uh, oh, this this little guy right here too. Um, again, modern but same exact chassis. Um, so I will I will be sacrificing this. I have my own Dumping A, and um, you know, I just ordered this one. It was like $5 on eBay, whatever. Uh, but the reason why I'll be doing that is um, I can take this body and get rid of this whole plastic section, the fenders and the running boards, um, and just discard that and drop the body down over, uh, over this chassis. And it makes for a really cool uh, hot rod. And I will probably be, build, be building that car uh, for my Labor Day race. It'll be a hot rod that I will be running um, in, in Labor Day. And that way, you know, I can maybe build a little bit of hype for that race. And you guys can see what you'd be up against and stuff. So uh, with, that, um, with that, just know before you even get started... Uh, I will be placing a length requirement on that, and it will be two and three quarter inches. And you can see these guys are well under that. It's the overall length of the car. This one's about two and five eighths. Um, the reason why I do that is to keep the racing close. You know, I, I could easily say, "Oh, we'll build a hot rod," and then somebody builds a, a way too fast. And a way too fast, I think, is about three and a half inches long. And that is a big advantage. So by keeping the lengths set and the weights set, uh, all, all very similar, that way it keeps the racing close. Uh, so that's just a real quick, quick intro into what you can look forward to. I'll probably be doing the swap on the, um, with the 300 chassis next, because again, that's pretty much just a swap onto a 300 chassis. So it's not really too involved. I mean, I'll get into some body modification, but it's pretty straight up swap. And um, another car that would qualify uh, for that for the race in uh, in September would be the 32 Ford. These are actually a little short, but I've had I've had good luck with these cars. I, I don't really know why. I've I've built a bunch of them in the past. And it's just a casting that works really well. And if I really wanted to, I could use this body and drop it down over one of these chassis also. But I think I will be using the 34 Ford, basically just because um, just get rid getting rid of this purple car. Uh, just on a side note, uh, I will be building some cars. I don't know, I'll probably give you updates, but I don't know if I'll build them step by step online. There's a, there's a first ever mod race at the uh, on the Calgary track, um, he's run. They're running 60 gram Vegas and 100 gram Honda Odysseys. So uh, you know you can only be the first winner once. So it's kind of cool to get in on those inaugural events. And uh, if I could uh, put together a cool car for uh, one of those classes, 
I have the um, the Odyssey, as you can see here, that's going to be getting packed full of lead, and I have uh, have some Vegas uh, coming. So I'll probably probably keep you guys updated on that. I think that race is coming up in July, so I want to get I want to get um, those cars put together pretty quick so I can get them in the mail. Um, you know, probably by middle of the month or, or so. So I will be building those. I know there is a little bit of um, excitement about the fact that the Calgary track is going to be running mods for the first time. So that's kind of cool. But, uh, but again, uh, this is just, you know, uh, cars that are eligible for the, uh, the race in uh, September. Uh, you could build a neat streeter. I wouldn't recommend cutting up one of these because they're just really, really cool. Uh, this is a, thir is a 36 Ford, I believe, or a custom, custom 36, uh, with the rumble seat and everything. This is just a really cool car. But, um, but again, that's just letting you know what's coming up. And, um, this is Chris. I will see you in lane two.